be terrific. Official coverage of CES 2017. And we are back live at the Sands Expo and Convention Center. It is be terrific. And CES 2017 rolls on. I moved over into the sports and fitness section of Eureka Park. And the first item that caught my eye here is called the Tennybot, is that? That's perfectly correct, Tennybot. It's a world first robotic tennis ball collector. That's amazing. So, you know, we see a lot of fitness products uh, for a lot of different sports, a lot of different, um, you know, things for specifically your body, but this now gets very sports specific. Uh, we're looking at tennis. My mother happens to be a big tennis player. Uh, I certainly have dabbled a little bit, uh, but one thing that I know just from looking around the various tennis courts is that one of the big problems is you don't always have someone to play with. And a lot of times you go out and you practice and you end up with balls all over the place. You might be practicing serving, you might be practicing backhands, or even if you do have someone, a coach or something like that, the coach isn't going to chase after the balls. So this is gonna solve that problem. Tell us a little bit how it works. So it's actually, the main reason it was born was because of that. We were tired of picking up balls and there's nothing on the market. Either the manual book car arbor takes forever, not practical, or the bush mowers was still very heavy, expensive, and you cannot be using it everywhere. So we started working on the tennis ball a year and a half ago, and it actually was a, a, a basic, the concept behind it was how to solve this problem with an elegant solution that be able to be moving on the court, light, effective. So it uses cameras and sensors to detect the ball on the court and recognize its location so that after it goes back up the balls based on your decision, you have an app comes with a uh, tennis ball, you can decide where you want it to pick up the ball. At the fence, at the net, all over the court. So you can be resting or you can be playing or you keep hitting. Let's say you are hitting with a tennis ball machine. You can keep hitting with the tennis ball picking up balls for you. And once you are done, it can come back to you or go wait by the next tennis ball machine so that you can keep playing or take out the tennis ball the balls out of the tennis ball and drop it in the tennis ball machine. All right, so let's get a demo going. Uh, let's see how this works. So as you can see, we just start the app. There's two balls on the floor. And here we go. Boom. That easy. Yes. So the idea is that it have modes where you can actually control where you want it to go. Like because this is like a large RC car, but the mo most convenient feature in it that you actually don't have to control it. The autonomous feature, it's like autonomous vehicles. You have that it detects the ball based on size, color, and shape, and go after them. And once it's done, it fills up at 70 balls. It come towards you. Yeah, so 70 balls, which is pretty amazing. And we talked about this earlier. I said, well, you know, a lot of times you might be on a public tennis court. There are six different courts, and you only want to pick up balls on yours, and you can program all that no problem. Exactly. So actually, one of the main features in the app, let's say you're on a tennis court, you are a, whether you're a pro, you, you are playing on this tennis court all the time, so you can save it. But at the same time, let's say you are teaching a group lesson on a couple of courts and you want to pick it over there. Then you can decide where you want it to pick a ball. Maybe in one side of all those three courts, maybe in all the three courts, maybe in one court. And this is the plan. That's amazing. And of course, we're in Eureka Park, so this product is in development. Talk to us about the timetable getting it to market. So right now we have been making working on this product for more than a year and a half. We just started taking reservations on our website. It, the demand was crazy. We didn't anticipate that much people actually have the same problem until we came here and started showing the number showing up on our website. So the reservations for free. And then once we start emailing the users around uh, May, this is basically we're telling them we are ready. We finalized the, all the iterations and we did our, finished our testing and we're ready to go into production. This will basically send them an email if they are interested in buying the product. And then we start shaving by November, December this year. So it'll be ready this year. How much is it going to cost? Uh, it's going to be around the cost of $8.99. Right now, we're trying to make sure we finish all our testing so that once the user have it, we, those early adopters start giving us feedback on what do they love and what do they want to change in their product deal. Now, just for cost reference, how much does a tennis ball machine cost? It will go all the way from eight, dollars $900 to $6,000, but any typical good ones are going to be around two, three thousand dollars $3,000. So, I mean, for a third of the cost, you now have solved both problems. <laughs> Hopefully, tennis players get to enjoy playing more tennis and less picking up balls. That is really amazing, the Tennybot. Another product you have here, the Perform Pro, uh, that is 
a wearable device specifically for tennis. Talk about that a little bit. Yeah, so the idea behind the Perform Pro is we wanted some, you go take a tennis lesson, you play really well, you play with a coach, you are very familiar with the shots, and then once you get off the court and you start playing with your friends, you switch back to your old habits. With Perform Pro, keep track of all your swings, forehand, backhand, serve, tell you how good the swings are, give you a speed of your swings, and actually give you some minor hints on what you need to change so that you stay. So think of it as something to keep you honest when you are playing on a tennis court. Make sure you are not switching into bad habits of giving you a bad elbow or or start slicing and dicing. That's really amazing. You know, tennis being an individual sport, uh, it's great that you guys have products here that you could help really work on it as an individual, even though it's a sport that you need someone else to play with. So, uh, Tennybot, check them out. What's the website? It's tennybot.com. Please check out the website, see the video, and check out the products. That is truly amazing. The health and fitness section here at the Sands Expo and Convention Center. We're going to go back over to the Las Vegas Convention Center where Michael's standing by. CES 2017 rolls on. Jason Aaron here with Be Terrific. We'll be back. We're going to go head back upstairs and catch up with you after we go to Michael. Be Terrific, official coverage of CES 2017.